Hi everyone, this is Alicia Smith from Alicia Smith Designs, and I am um, excited to bring an um, unboxing from the Mommy and Me Crafts uh, Spring Flower Swap. And I've been holding on to this package for a while because I wanted to give it to my full attention. And I've been seeing all the reveals. So let's jump into it. Oh, yes. Look at these. All right. So I don't know who my swap partners are. And so just take in all the fun festive shred here. And that was hosted by Patty at Mommy and Me. And look at all of the fun die cuts and punches. Really clever way to add some interest to your shred mix. Oh, nice. A really cute bag. Let me make sure you can see it. There we go. All right, beautiful purple and pretty paper. We've got some die cuts here, some thread some embossed paper and stitching she's done really nice look at that and the velcro closure we open it up Fun. wow we've got let me see who oh the spotted owl this is her information from bren really cute I love it and oh, she's chosen uh, fabric as a medium and so she's got a really cute bag topper here she's repurposed some packaging let's see if I can get in it without tearing it up I cannot I gotta go for it all right look at these now, Brand, I'm going to need a tutorial. Look at these little flowers. And it looks like this is seam binding. So she's got a purple and a white. So we were supposed to make two large, four medium, and six small. Oh, she's chosen several different medium. These look like they're clay. Nice. Very talented. And we were asked to use colors that could go with a variety of paper packs. So nothing too specific. Really pretty. Look at that rose. That pink rose. And these are perfect too. So again, Brent, I'm going to need some information. Really cute. Can you all see that? There we go. Really pretty. And I'm wondering, are these clay? All kinds of great spring colors. Really nice. And then her large ones, too large, are felt, I believe. I'm just gonna bust into them. And we've got a pink and a white. Look at that. So fun. I can see this on a closure to a handmade purse. Really nice bag toppers. Really pretty. Thank you so much. And, so, and then again, lots of fun die cuts and punches. Really great way to use those punches too. Love it. Thank you very much, Bryn. This was a fun swap, and this was a fun group of ladies to get to, to um, swap with. So that's her bag. And I will pop these right in. Actually, I'm going to leave them out so you can see them. And I will move these items out of the way. And then let's jump into... Our next one, this is some pretty pink tissue. Move these over. Oh, really pretty. Spring 
flower swap. Look at that. That is, it looks to be perhaps a um, cutting machine, spring flower shop tag. Really pretty. And then look at this bag topper. So we've got rolled flowers. We've got some additional flowers under and a doily. Really pick. And then she stitched the bag. Nice. And we've got seam binding closure. And I still don't know who this is yet, but I'm going to find out. I think I saw this reveal or this project share. And now i got to remember who it was. And so you open it. Do I, have, I don't want to tear it. Let's see. Well, first of all, let's look at this um, um, sequence. I was, I was trying to come up with a word. Really fun mix of flowers and circles in a spring color. And I do not want to tear this up. So how do I get into it? Oh, really fun. I think I remember seeing this. And these are the cutest. And this is a die. I want to say these dies are from Scrap Diva 29, maybe? Look at this pretty paper with the beautiful pearl cl uh, clusters around here. And a pretty... Um, pink heart closure and I'll start with the larger one I know who this is I gotta think about this I saw these and they open right up Eileen Payne I knew I saw it really really pretty yes wonderful thank you so she's done three different pack and, and part of the swap was that our packaging had to be special. Our packaging had to be part of the swap. So not just the flowers. And so she's chosen to use two felt large flowers. They look to be rolled. And I, you know, I don't use felt a lot. I'm going to have to try my hand at that. And then she's included some, included some really cute small ones. These are, I'm working with a lot of small flowers right now. So these will fit right in. Really cute. Then I'll go to the medium and do take in this paper. Wow. Look at that shine. Again, trim all around. And this die just opens right up. Oh, wow. And we've got these really pretty rolled flowers. And she's done some inking around the edges in yellow and pink. Love it. Thank you. Oh, I didn't see these two here. Some more small flowers. Really pretty. Look at that. Your hands had to be really tired. Those are tiny, tiny. And then this is the third set. Love that pink and blue combination. Really pretty. I don't know what paper pad this is, but this is a really pretty paper pad. And then, oh yeah, look at these. So we've got the other three, no, we've got three small rolled flowers. And then we've got a different take here. Look at this one. We've got, it looks to be like a light yellow and maybe a lavender and then white. I've been experimenting with different punches and just trying to see different ways that I can put um, I can create different flowers from the same punch and the same dyes so that's been a challenge I'm working on for myself and these are just the cutest Eileen thank you so much for swapping as well as Brie at the Spotted Owl so we got Eileen Payne and then we got Bren excuse me Bren at the Spotted Owl and that's all of her information. And this is Eileen's information. Eileen Payne. 
for YouTube and Instagram and really cute die set. So it's nice to see that in person. person. I really like that zipper. That's a, to me, a trademark of, um, Nicole. <laughs> I have some of her other dies and she has zippers like that. So really fun. All right. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Thank you ladies for swapping with me. This has been a really fun. I really appreciate it. Thank you, Patty, for hosting and I'll see you the next time.